Good day, friends. Welcome back to the homestead. So, last time we were here, which was three days ago, we had uh, we had a couple of burn piles going. We burned a lot of old branches and stuff that needed to needed to go away. Um, so I was walking the property this morning, came across the burn piles, out of curiosity, reached down, and there's still a ton of heat coming out of those. So I'm going to stir those up a little bit so that they will uh, stop being hot, so they'll cool down. <laughs> Okay, I am looking into the sun, so I don't even know if you can, if I'm even looking at the camera, but right behind me here are these big bushes. Remember those zigzag spiders and the bushes that they were in, and they're just leafy thing, and I cut something, and I said, anybody know what this is? Well, nobody told me what that was, but now I see. These are cockaburr bushes. Big bushes with gigantic cockaburrs all over the place. They're green right now, but they're going to turn brown and they're going to hurt really bad. So anyway, they stick right now. They're not soft. I went like this and uh, you can feel the prickers. But we're going to get these out of here this weekend, get them over the burn pile so we're not dropping these uh, cockaburr everywhere. Because um, cockaburrs are probably the seeds that will plant them everywhere else if we don't get, get them out of here. Anyway, let me show you closer. As you can see, Lee has wasted no time at all getting those bushes out of here and to the burn pile, which is a good thing because we don't want to forget. And uh, I don't know when they turn brown, <laughs> but we don't want to wait for it. We have a whole bunch over here that have started growing their cockerburrs. Okay, over here we've got two different types of plants. We have this one here that is green, and then we have these right here that look like they're kind of a light green with a light type of blossom thing going on. 
Don't know what it is. Could be more stickers that are disguising themselves as something. Something. I don't know. There we go. What is this? Anybody know what this is? And while you're looking it up, tell us what this is right here. Here's one of those wildflowers. Pretty purple leaves, but they have thorns. All is this one of the thorns? Yep, all up and down the trunk and on the leaves. Thorns. We have very few trees on the property that do not have thorns. This one is one of them. Do you recognize what type of tree this is? What type of fruit it is growing on it? Is this a kumquat tree? I don't even know what a kumquat looks like. If you recognize this tree, let us know what it is. It'd be nice to know whether or not this fruit that's growing is edible or not. Sure would be fun if I could make some jam or something with this fruit so it's not just growing here and dropping on the property making a mess.
one of the things we have to be careful with by going into this pile is that they, we saw a snake go in there. So we know that there's snakes in there. And so that's why I poke along before I br step forward. Because if there's a snake in there, I want him to go the opposite direction. Anyway, it looks like we've cleared this path pretty good. There's one or two over there in that side. But uh, hopefully we can get these burned before the cockaburs seed all over the place. Because over there, where we've been burning, that's going to be the garden area in, in time, hopefully this spring. <laughs> 